popular restaurant in New Smyrna Beach is closed right now after a truck slammed into that business overnight. The driver was taken to the hospital with non-life threatening injuries. West 2's Claire Metz reports the damage is extensive at the Sandbar Cafe on South US 1. It's kind of shocking. A call from police about 12.30 a.m. brought Sandbar Cafe owner Spiro Trifonopoulos to his closed restaurant where he found it open in a most unfortunate way. A driver in a pickup went off-road, crashing into the building through and through. Both of the walls are gone, all my tables are gone, a lot of chairs are gone, some of the countertop, my stools. Um, it's pretty substantial damage. It appears the driver missed a curve in the road, went between this palm tree and the sandbar restaurant sign, then straight back into the restaurant. Maybe a hundred yards or more. There's no indication that we can see that the driver ever applied the brakes. No skid marks in the parking lot. This is a picture of the truck the driver was in, dented and scratched from hitting a concrete pole before hitting the building. The driver has not been identified and there's no information right now about what led him to lose control. Police will only say there is an ongoing criminal investigation. Meanwhile, owner Trifonopoulos is dealing with insurance, scope of repair work. Try to fix this place up again and open back up for business. I don't know if it's going to be two months, three months, four months, however long it is. He certainly wants to come back for his employees for his customers, many of whom stopped by to say how sorry they are. I love feeding people. I like, you know, people telling me the food is good and there's smiles on their face. And, you know, we know all the locals around here and, you know, we thank the locals too for their support. In New Smyrna Beach, Volusia County, Claire Metz, West 2 News. We have had no update on the condition of the driver.